And today we'll be taking a look at um, Fans Toys Hitch. That's always, the box is always cool. Nice indentations, nice color, nice gloss to it. Um, in the back, you got his bio, whatever. Um, you have his pictures, Trail Breaker, Hitch, Jazz, and Mirage. And um, so, yeah, the box is look, good, looking good as always. I was too lazy to pull out the X Trans box, box to do a comparison with it. So it's just a box, so I really didn't bother with it. Let's get this out the way and bring out Hoist. And here he is, looking. Oh shit, here, let me pick him up. Here he goes. There he goes. There he is, looking good. I love the green on it. That that green is popping real good. Um, I love the legs on it. I love the orange. The orange pops good. Um, I love the chrome on the way the paint, the gray painted on the feet. Love the way the tires are set up on here. These little arm plates in the back. I like how they rotate so you can kind of get a good pose. The arms are cool. I think a little bit thin, but um, I think that's how it was in the cartoons. I'm still tripping how um, they use the chrome on these legs. Um, the back cleans up very, very well. I like that. I dig it. Um... I wish the little antenna thing in the back of his head was better articulated, but it is die cast, so that works pretty good. And you can see not much really of a backpack except for those two little wings that pop up. And the guy has some hate of some legit heft to him. My hips are a little loose, but I think a lot of people had them like that. And here is a X Trans box hoist. And, uh, I've transformed this guy four times, and you can see here I got some stress. See, the shoulders broke on him. Got stress right here. Um, and he's only been transformed four times. He's about four years old. The arms, I like how they're thick, but you can't really get no uh, articulation. You see right there where I transformed four times, that spring is not good no more. I like the back of it, though, you know. I appreciate these little lights here. I think the toe here works much better in vehicle mode. The antenna articulates really good, a lot better than the fans toys. But here you see both of them are, are uh, two worlds apart. The fans toys looks complete. As to where the trans spots, you can see the screws and everything sticking out and it doesn't look too complete either. Like it was just thrown together. But overall, um, this is where the shoulders, I, I prefer the head color better on the X-Trans bots than the uh, fans toys here. So let's slide them over a little bit and we'll bring out a comparison here. We'll bring out a wheel jack. And uh, I think this scale is pretty good. I think he looks better with the, uh, with the fans toys version of Hoist. But either way, um, you can't go wrong with either company X-Trans bots or the fans toys. But I just stay away from X trans bots because their shit doesn't tend doesn't tend to hold well for the long run. That's why I'm not buying the Ultra Magnus here. We'll bring out a Warpath, and you know I'm crapping on X trans bots, but I just brought out this Warpath, and the knees were shot on this thing. And uh, so this is not another toy that I like to transform a lot. Here he goes with the um, horse goes to Hollywood faces. You can see the. Fans Toys got the darker green mask and uh, the X-Trans box is like grayish, whitish. But yeah, so that Warpath is a toy that I didn't like to transform and I stay away from. And here we got him transformed in this truck mode. And I think this looks more like real world. And I appreciate that. I like the chrome on the grill. Um, it rolls very well, very, very well. I like the gray going along the side of the truck with the two little yellow stripes on there. Um, I like the tinted to detail from the cartoons at the top. You know how they were kind of like tinted windows at the top. Um, I love the paint job on the uh, the headlight, the tail lights and the brake lights. It looks real good. I love the orange up here. You can see the head here, but I guess it could be some kind of toolbox or something. Doesn't really matter. There's a tab that goes up under there that I couldn't quite get in, so. But the whole front hood right there is, is die cast. Straight die cast. Very, very nice. Can you look at the bottom of it? And uh, put him back. Slide him over a little bit. And we'll go ahead and bring out uh, X-Trans Box Hoist. And the X-Trans Box Hoist is more real world here. 
they got the yellow and black lines going all the way across the toolbox the bed in the back has a real box i like these lights the toe here works much better or the hitch here works much better than the uh fast toys one but um yeah but you can tell here let me open this up and show you a lot the the hitch close these back up slide these open i like this on the x trans box you can slide them open and i think that works better than what the fans toys was aiming for but it, it you know i the fans toys has just made so much better that uh you know i don't even care how the other truck works a little bit better and everything for me is in is robot mode really and we'll bring in jazz out here i'm gonna turn for you i think this works it looks pretty good i like it I don't care for the plus stuff or anything like that. I feel like they're just trying to take my money. See here? Doesn't really work too well. And here he'll he'll sit inside those sliding rails for the tires. That, that works much better. Much, much better. Go ahead and pull him out, put him back where he was at. And let's get ready for the party shot here. And so here we got them together, the party shop. The Fans Toys is way, way more awesome. It's better made, better built, better painted. Um, it's not without its flaws for sure. I appreciate these moving a lot better for better articulation, better poses. But um, the hips on my Fans Toys are a little looser on the floppy side. So it's kind of hard to get him to stand. But once he's standing, he's good. And then we'll take a look at the, the X-Trans bots here. And the X-Trans bots, like I say, I like the back lights on it. The toe, the hitch is much better. The antenna is more articulated. Um, these don't move like the fans toys. Um, so there's ups and um, downs with the other one. Like the arms, I appreciate these arms. They're more thicker. And I think it's better than looking in the thin, thin arms of the fans toys. But overall, you know, right up in here, those arms, those shoulders right there that's held by a screw, those broke when I transformed it, plus these stress marks. And I only transformed it four times. Two times on the first review and two times here. That's why I stay away from the x transbot stuff. But overall, you know, shelf, shelf appearances is perfect if you want something cheap. The x transbots will do you well. Um, we'll go ahead and bring out the uh, wheel jack one last time. But if you want a well-made toy that you're not really too scared to transform and I think will last and put up the test of time, it's the fans toys. Hope you guys enjoy the video to all our 